This is Roblox, the wildly popular online platform with more than 43 million daily users who both play and create games on their own. And while its bright colors and block-like avatars may appear kid-friendly, some users, like 17-year-old Brianna Toms, say Roblox can be anything but child's play. What's different about this story and this reporting is that we're seeing examples of these cases shifting from the online world into the offline world, where kids are being physically kidnapped, abducted, and sexually assaulted by predators who have connected with them on Roblox. Roblox told the BBC, we have zero tolerance for sexual content or behavior of any kind. With our zero tolerance for inappropriate content and behavior, we have no tolerance for content or behavior. We have zero tolerance for sexual content or behavior of any kind, and we take swift action to address any content or developer. We take swift and immediate action, firm and swift action, take swift action, swift, swift action, action, typically within minutes. You hear it all the time. Roblox is a kid's game. How can Roblox have mature content? You'd be dead wrong if you believed any of these statements. Every day there are hundreds of games being uploaded, hundreds of avatar items being uploaded, and hundreds of accounts being made. Every bit of content being created on the platform is being checked by Roblox's moderation system. However, this system has been proven to be ineffective during a test with the Mod for Dummies team. In this video, I will show you how easy it is for your child to see this content, even with parental controls. The Marketplace is a part of the website where you can buy items for your avatar. Roblox has made it so anyone can create an avatar item and publish it on the marketplace. This comes with risks, though. When you make anything public, you need a team ready to moderate and enforce the rules. Unfortunately, Roblox does poorly with enforcing the rules. This has allowed items such as shaders to be uploaded. Shaders are the tamest thing. Unfortunately, items have been uploaded that reference known NSFW creations. There are clothing items that even give your avatar female chest-like proportions. You may argue that games like Fortnite have these same proportions when it comes to your skin, and you'd be right. However, unlike Fortnite, Roblox allows full customization of your avatar. There is no restriction that checks if your avatar is too lewd. Anyone can purchase these items and make their avatar like that. If Roblox cared about children seeing lewd content, they would have put their foot down and cracked down on these items. When you normally make your Roblox account, you choose what your username is. You don't have full control since NSFW usernames get filtered. At least, that's what you would think. The AI that handles this filter isn't aware of the new lingo kids use nowadays. This leads to accounts with very obvious NSFW usernames being passed through. This has caused a surge of ERP accounts being created for the sole purpose of finding others for ERP. They tend to use the profile bio to list out their desires and how to contact them. Most of them have a Discord username attached in the bio, which has kids go off the platform onto Discord, which has no chat filter. This is a major security issue that Roblox has yet to solve. Another form of these accounts is how they look. It ranges from lewd femboys to exposed females, all of this while passing through moderation. Roblox has hundreds of games for you to play. These range from high-action fighting games to a peaceful wonderland in a castle. Roblox has it all, and I mean that literally. In the dark parts of Roblox, games exist that kids shouldn't see. These games are known as condo games. In these games, your character interacts with others in a very NSFW way that I cannot describe on YouTube. It should be obvious that these games break TOS, however they still get past moderation. 
Roblox has been making an effort recently to stop these games, but the amount being uploaded daily is overwhelming the moderation team. Another major issue that I've been noticing is ERP account playing normal games that kids play. You would expect to see people dressed in such a way in condo games, however, it seems they are spreading to games meant for kids. It doesn't matter if you have parental controls on the account, your child can still find these people wandering around. Every day more and more of these people are being found in normal games, and it's only getting worse. So what can you do to help? You can help by joining the Mod for Dummies Discord server using the link below. You can make a ticket, and our team of very competent associates will review your issue and provide a solution if there is one. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you made it this far, then please like the video and subscribe to the channel. It motivates me to make more videos like this for y'all. See y'all next time.